Hi, everyone. Welcome back to The Front Room. I'm Kai, and I'm here with my dad today. Thank you very much for joining us today. Why are we here? Uh, <laughs> On Earth. No. It's, it's a, it's a rapper. It's a newer rapper who's been around. Uh, well, a newer rapper who's just released an album. <laughs> and there's a lot of hoopla, a lot of... Uh, lot of talk about this one sure is and i'm trying to remember his name <laughs> it's not denzel curry it's uh jpeg mafia no, no. <laughs> who is it who? Oh, does that person still exist jpeg mafia yeah yeah, yeah. Oh. she still oh, makes stuff. uh it's i've only mentioned it and planned this for the past <laughs> five days i can't remember the guy's name yeah usually we don't reveal what we or I don't reveal what I show you, but since it's a new album, oh, do man. give me the first name. It's last deep. name is Scott. Oh God, come Shoot. on! I can't remember Travis his Scott. Travis Scott. <laughs> Travis Scott. Okay. Yeah, and we're yeah. we're covering a brand new album. At the time of recording this, it's been out for just over an hour or so. Wow, talk about fresh. Fresh, yes. Wow. And uh, here's the like here's a, the cover. Like a loaf of freshly baked bread. Ooh. That is a really neat cover. I like that a lot. He almost looks like an MMA fighter who's just been hit or something. <laughs> yeah. And what's around his waist? Some big fancy belt? Almost like a, yeah. uh, a title belt. Yeah, it does. MMA title belt or it something. It does. Wow. Mm -hmm. That's really uh, interesting. Disney. And then this yeah. was his uh, previous album cover. So this is one album, alternate covers for the album for his uh, 2015 sort of like quintessential album called Rodeo. It's, uh, in well, my opinion, on, Travis's best. On the right side there, he looks like uh, a G.I. Joe doll from the yeah. 1960s. Yeah, yeah. He actually released limited edition dolls of himself. So that is a doll. Then. Yeah, it is. Yeah, it yeah, is. yeah, yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah. His last album was when? 2018. That's the one just oh. over there to the, the right, so if you want to look. five years ago. Yeah. Huge. Oh, it's one I've of the biggest that, albums yeah. of the past wow. however many years. Huge. Cool. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Like everyone knows about it. It was so much so much hype. Same as this one. He finally released it. It is called Utopia. And I don't really have much to say about it because I haven't listened to it. Utopia. So Utopia means a perfect world. Yeah. So I wonder if there's any uh connection in the lyrics to mm -hmm. the title. Yeah. Aside from that one newish album by um Kendrick Lamar, mm -hmm. I haven't heard any and that was a whole year ago. Yeah. I haven't heard any new rap. Mm -hmm. At all. Because we've been doing the uh, a bit of 80s, a lot of the 90s, the 2000s, Thousands. right? That's pretty much it. Yeah. Yeah. So this is... Well, let's just... Uh, <laughs> let's just... I don't even know how to approach this. I, yeah. I don't know how to approach it either. Yeah. You know, so mm -hmm. let's just... Get into it. Get into it. Man. Okay. Sounds yeah. good. Yeah. Come in. That must be our drinks. Hey, say... <laughs> How's it going? Good, how are you? Good, good. <laughs> okay, so I've made two drinks for you guys. Uh -huh. Trying to stay with like a utopia-ish theme. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, so the first one is just uh, like a gin and tonic. But gin and like, tonic. kind of changes colors. So, okay, you got the, the gin and tonic in the glass, and what's in the shot glass? So it's tonic in the glass and then gin in the shot glass. Say and that again? It's tonic in the Oh, just tonic, glass, okay. And yeah. then gin and they just pour it in all right and it should turn like a fun color what the heck yeah isn't that, isn't oh, that what fun? Does that happen? um it's just like a chemical reaction with the acid in the tonic water um I, well i've had gin and tonics before this you can has kind of never happened the camera kind of this has never happened before when i've had a gin yeah, and tonic why is yours okay, why is your tonic? Separate? <laughs> okay. i didn't oh. make shots <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> okay, so this. Uh, well, this is an event. So <laughs> this is uh, most appropriate, I would say. Yeah. So this is a shot of what? It's a big shot for God's It is sake. a big shot, but it's actually. Don't worry, there's only a, a total of like an ounce of alcohol, so it's, I guess, not crazy. Say, if I told you the, the last time I got drunk, it was like 20 or 30 years ago. <laughs> I don't actually remember. Tonight's gonna be the night again. <laughs> So, are you telling me what's in it? Yeah, it's a rum and a raspberry liqueur or something. Oh, wow. Yeah, so it should taste like candy. There you go. Not bad. Where'd you learn how to drink like that? Not from me. Go, go! <laughs> <laughs> Tasty. Yeah. I like that one. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, there's rum, and you like rum. 
Mm. All right. All right, let's get into the first track. And I believe the drinks Utopia. will not stop. So oh, you better goodness. you better prepare. Okay. I love the title, Utopia. It just makes me wonder what this is all about. Yeah, it is a really good title. He, he's an expert at marketing himself, for sure. Is he? Mm-hmm. Visually and, and everything. He was going to do the concert at the Pyramids, but then it got cancelled last minute. So, apparently some person sold their house to go, and then it got cancelled. Is that because of COVID? No, I, no. I think it was too insane of a, of a venue to plan. Uh-huh. Security must have been minute. crazy. Yeah. Right. Yeah, and yeah. so they, they just called it off. Yeah. 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 But he's doing crazy stuff. Okay, what's the first track? The first yeah. track is Hyena. The I can I can read. <laughs> we are in at this time neither a good one. Oh! Stop it. Stop it. Things can change, things can stay the same. This is from a band called Gentle Giant. Oh, with the big face on the cover, right? Uh, one of their albums. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. I think it came out in um, 74, 75. Really? Yeah, yeah, wow. yeah. Uh, a prog rock group from England. It, it says here Derek Shulman. Yeah. Is seeing that. So things, yeah, legit. things can see. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> uh, wow, well, that's cool. Yeah. It can change. Yeah, yeah. It can stay the, the same. same. I can see. I can make my Oh, this is very uh, true to the uh, original so far. It sounds like Whoa. a particular era of Kanye. You hear that, like, sliding percussion? That sh- yeah. yeah, that's weird. Okay, this shit is out of control. I'm driving through hell and I done brought snow. It's shining in here and I done brought gold. You know it's lemon water while we gotta fill the stands. Oh, what a- the <laughs> I love that beat. I got you in yeah. Stances, with your model stances. You everything I know about it. 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 I'm shocked, honestly. This doesn't sound like anything Travis has done lately. Really? Yeah. I like his voice. His voice? Yeah. In high school, everyone thought it was the coolest thing when, when he came out. Great tone. Uh, that sound that hey. right there. Yeah, that's a Kanye signature sound. Yeah. So is Kanye producing? Yeah, I don't know. It says produced by Travis Scott and Wonder Girl, mm-hmm. but uh, that it's called like a, a vox. A vox, a vocal audio effect type of sound. Um, that vox has been used by a bunch of people because it was popularized by Kanye. I think it might be a James Brown type, type thing, type sample. Yeah, from a live show. I forget if that was exactly. Synthesizers. Heavy synthesizers. That's a Travis classic. Is it? Yeah. That reminds me of Prog Rock uh-huh. from the 70s. Uh, this is refreshing because I, like, I haven't heard any modern rap aside from that Kendrick album. Yeah. It's so, it's so, so weird different from the rap stuff. I've heard. Yeah. <laughs> Completely different. Yeah. You know? in the, in the, the, sonically, the, the sounds, the instrumentation, and, and that rhythm and some of the percussion is very different. Yeah. Yeah. So very much so. Yeah, I'm enjoying this so far. Yeah, nice. That this has got me excited. I was ready to sort of be disappointed just oh, cuz yeah. it's been so long. How would he how would he top his last yeah. project sort of thing? But this has really got me excited. Right. Audio is working okay, sir. I won't doubt it. I won't. He won't mislead all his followers. Praying on the process. Mind and spirit. Feel like, like I'm floating in my prime time. This has a really like nocturnal feel. It does, yeah. 
Yeah. It's really low key, but then those that, that explosion of that deep synth comes in. I feel like I'm sitting in my car convertible. On Your a imaginary hit. convertible car. Yeah. <laughs> sitting on a on a hill, high, high hill, looking down at a city yeah. at night and just contemplating Still no things. Pressure. Yeah. I don't know. God, I this is a crazy beat switch here. Shit I speak is what they need. I tell no lies. I'm still up top and still can't drop what they not. Mm. Yeah. Last day was filled with slaps. I guess gotta run this shit back. Then like the way this shit went down after the was I made it, it turned to a beast. This that shit right here that get me going. After I pop me a piece, where did we killing the critics and killing the hate? Might gotta talk. But you know she living major, and then the baby voice that's right, daddy. So Stormy is his daughter. Oh. What happens in Vegas stays in Vegas. Do you know that expression? Yeah, of course. Okay. Of course. I'm not sure which expressions you know, which you don't, right? <laughs> I guess, yeah. Vice versa, right? With me? Yeah, true, yeah. true. I like that one. Yeah, me too. I like that. I mean, I got to go back and read the lyrics and try and, and you know, figure out what he's, you know, yeah. rap rapping about, but... And I, again, I like his voice. It's just so easy to listen to. I think that's why he has such a big reach as well. Really? Eh? Yeah. Yeah. It's just, uh, yeah. There's, it, it seems very uh, kind of, in a way, ordinary, mm -hmm. but it's got a great tone, a really nice smoothness to it. I, yeah. lo I love it. I love yeah, it. yeah. Yeah. It's fantastic. Well, I, I want to do another cheers. Okay. There we go. <laughs> to all of you wonderful uh, followers of our channel. You guys are fantastic. I mean it. I mean the no, really the the um, the support you've given us, the encouragement, and also the info, the insight to all of these songs. So thank you very much. <laughs> Cheers. This album's way darker than Astroworld, his previous one. Just in, in the sound? Yeah. I like you better in the stands. This shit punk put it on the Bible. I like a bi girl on a bicycle. Then I bought a car and I should build a title. I dick so hard, poking like the Eiffel. I remember those days. I don't know what that means in all of those lyrics there, but. Yeah. It's funny anyway. <laughs> this is Tease of Touchdown. Oh. It collaborates with a bunch of big artists. It's the first bit of singing in the on the yeah. album. This is the third song, and it, every one of them has been so different from the previous one. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, completely. Yeah. It is really good, though. It is. I wanted to ask you. I'm super shocked. Me Are you? Too. I was on the same page as Kai. I wasn't expecting much. Yeah. I thought he'd already reached his peak, so, you know, yeah. like, what, what can come out of it? But very shocking, to say the least. Very good. Yeah. I wasn't sure how much you'd like this. Oh, yeah? Not, not, I mean, I know your taste in music to a certain degree, but not mm. entirely, right? But I just wondered if this was the sort of thing that uh, would appeal to you. So that's great. Yeah, I'm curious to see how the rest of the album will Yeah, let's hope it keeps up. Yeah, Wouldn't right? <laughs> yeah, I mean... It, it, hopefully it's, it's not front-loaded. It's difficult. So that's yeah. why we should get on to the fourth track. This is My Eyes. My Eyes. This one has Wheezy in the production credits. Wheezy. <laughs> no, not, not, uh, not Lil Wayne. <laughs> Turn it. <laughs> 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 I was sworn in by a kiss. Going on a walk with a new 
so armor, new suit, dimbo, take it at sauna. Give me the heat from a sleep in armor. Cupid creep, then sleep with armor. Three times and gave me teen, teen, teen. Still same phone, 18, teen, teen. Still get a news very vividly. Beef in that fucking beef. Oh, his voice on this is so sick. Maybe that's just me, but it is very good. This part reminds me of Little Yachty's album. The vocals. Mm, mm. Sounds like Little Yachty. Yeah, yeah. From that album. What's the name of the album that we uh, covered? Let's, let's start here. Yeah. Look at my eyes, tell me your tail, do you see the road? I'm out to my soul, a tell me the size, whenever the smoke clear out of my face, in my picture perfect, or do I look fried? All of that green and yellow that drift in your eyes is telling, tell you demise, I'm with to my side to push back the This is a patented Travis flow. I replay the night, somewhere by my yeah. side, all I see is a sea of people that ride me, if they just knew what Scotty would do to jump out the stage and say I'm a child, if these are created, became the most weighted, I gotta find balance and keep me a smile. Yeah. That shit by the state of my hero, I took it for zero. The flame you saying I read it for miles. The shit was a lot, they got me fucked up. I put you on bus and take you around. A couple of guys inside of the school, I gave them the tools. Damn. I really enjoyed that one. That might be my favorite so far. Yeah? Yeah. That one was really like good. That? Holy shit. That was, that's the next song. That was so good. Yeah, yeah. That was so in, incredible. In what way? In what way? Well, he just. He absolutely went in on that, on the second half of the mm, song. There. Yeah, with the rapping, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah it just yeah. went on and on and on, and yeah. he found that flow. Yeah. Bought the crib on a hill, made it harder to reach, bought a couple more whips because I needed Must be got a couple more watches, I need more time. You know, that, yeah, yeah. I had to close my eyes because I just simply, you know, I couldn't keep <laughs> up with it. And I thought, if, if I'm going to be reading it like mad, yeah, and like crazy, um, um, you know, I just wanted to feel it, so I closed my eyes just to feel the, the sound. Yeah. You know. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. I get that. Solid. Yeah, I immediately added it to my liked song after <laughs> that second part started playing. Uh -huh. Yeah. The thing I like about Say, oh. among many things, <laughs> is that for someone your age, you you appreciate the newest of the new, and then you go back in time and you listen to, like, Etta James, Aretha Franklin, this old old school stuff, too. And I really like that. Oh, yeah? Yeah. 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 I don't know. It's it's fun. Yeah. I like listening to the old stuff yeah. and then comparing it, it to the new. Yeah, it's great. It's great that you do that. And Kaya, I know, and everybody who watches us knows that. Well, you're just well. saying, I know uh, you saying this about Say is going to make everyone beg, can we get her on the channel? <laughs> <laughs> I'm working on that. It, it's a slow process. <laughs> yeah. Produced by 30 Rock, Desiree, and Kanye West. Kanye again. I don't know the other producers. Only one ain't watching it. Yeah. Waking up, I see the light. I've been drunk and it's all right. <laughs> I took the dry to clear my mental. We'll take the whip, but it's a bite. It's demon time, I got it on me. My earner did drop overnight. Well, Louis shakes to block my psyche. It's out of hell well, where the ice. Okay, this is really cool because the voice, obviously it's peculiar, but the, the notes it's playing, the dun, 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 dun. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That sort of deflated melody, mm -hmm. you know, where it ends off like that. That's typically, if I were to hear it in a, in a sort of contemporary hip hop beat, it might mm -hmm. be a horn, some mm -hmm. sort of horn or a mm -hmm. trumpet, like... You, right. could, you could hear that same note pattern with oh, the they trumpet, use, you they know? They use horns in contemporary rap. Yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, it makes it have like a really punchy anth anthemic feel. Or maybe they're sort of, it's like dangerous. Uh -huh. But this with a vocal doing that makes it sort of, uh, it changes it yeah. completely from if it was a horn or something like that. Yeah. It's, 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 it sounds sort of uncomfortable and, and dangerous. Oh, wow. Yeah. Okay, I'm going li to listen for that now. Yeah, yeah, just the repetition with it, it, it mm -hmm. creates this atmosphere for sure. That was another well, interesting one. I found the drum pattern to be really interesting as well. Mm -hmm. The hi-hats, um, they were like so close together that it's almost like just a, I don't know, you, I can't replicate it, of course, but it doesn't sound like you're, tss, 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 it's like. Tss, tss. Oh, oh, really? Yeah, and they create a, they can even create a sort of like a 
a melody with the hi hats because oh, wow. they're so close together. Neat. That's that's something that they do in more recent music. They're really creative with the hats, uh, which we haven't really no. seen on the channel yet. No, but just yeah, the hi hats will be definitely continue to be interesting on the, this mm-hmm. album. I also realized that you finished your drink. No, not quite. Really? But I can. <laughs> um, about the hi hats, I think that my favorite hi hats. Possibly the favorite hi-hats I've heard on our channel mm-hmm. are from a song that we haven't actually put up on YouTube yet. It's on Patreon. Mm-hmm. Uh, it's from uh, Gucci Mane. Chicken Talk? I'm not sure if it was... No, was from, it? from Chicken Talk. It's 745. Yeah. 745. Oh, those hi-hats, I love them. That was produced by Juicy J and, and uh, yeah. DJ Paul. Oh, good stuff. So good. Yeah. yeah. Sounds like another sample. Yeah. I don't know what this time. Vocal sample comes from Siren. From Siren comes from the 1980 track Explore Suite by the Boston-based progressive rock band New England. Wow. We have to spread out the word. Mm. I was too dead determined. Rock game needed refurbished. I was up top with no service. Watches in our playing verses. They in the bushes, they lurking. My gotta call the insurgents. She wanna fuck with a purpose. I gotta juggle my urges. Bestie, be all. Oh, wow. Now I got your attention. It's wide and beaten. This evening, you never leaving. <laughs> Clock out, we sneaking. All the demons need a reason. But from 2 a.m. to 2 in the afternoon, it's a festival right in my room. Oh, that was good. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> so, this outro, the synths, yeah. dramatic, right? That's yeah. a staple of Travis. Is that? Yeah. Influenced by Kanye. I thought we were going to Utopia. What makes you say this isn't Utopia? I mean, I don't know. Isn't it supposed to be some perfect destination? This is just your hotel room. Yeah, it looks perfect to me. Do you know who that was at the no. speaking? No. The guy? No. Who was it? Drake. Drake! Drake! Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, okay. yeah. And lately, did, did you recognize his voice? Yeah, yeah. Say, did you recognize it? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh. It's so distinctly Drake. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I kind of like this last part though. Mm-hmm. Right? Thought we were going to Utopia. What makes you say this isn't Utopia? I mean, I don't know. Isn't it supposed to be some perfect destination? <laughs> this is just your hotel room. <laughs> yeah, it looks perfect to me. <laughs> like I don't know what all this means, but uh, uh-huh. I just found that funny and kind of <laughs> maybe deep in some way. I'm not sure. Yeah. Okay, maybe there's some heavy yep. metal guitar in this one. Tensions is definitely rising. Oh shit! Teed up right now. What? You know who this is? Rapper, they're talking. Drake again? Yeah. Oh. Oh. T-time. This is. Whenever Drake and Travis make a song together, it is the biggest thing. Oh, you kidding yeah, me? Yeah. Time. Tea time. Tea time. Tea time. Time for tea. Tea time like I got a cup of this shit. He is Canadian after all. Quarter to six. I love to fuck on a regular bitch. Famous host lady. It's funny because tea time. Tea time. Tea time. Tea time like I got a cup of this shit. Tea time like golf at a quarter to six. I love to fuck on a regular bitch. Famous host lady, but they stay on my dick. Heard your new joint is embarrassing shit. You talk to the cops on some therapy shit. You act like you love this American shit, but really the truth is you're scared of the six. Six six six. No, like to, six. Toronto is the six. Oh, okay, yeah. pause the pause the tape. <laughs> Toronto is the six. Yeah, yeah. It's How a, do I know? Not it's know a certain. That it's Canadian. a certain. It's a certain. I think uh, neighborhood in Toronto. Oh, called okay. the six. Okay, that's I forget. Is that where he's from? Yeah, and he's from that area. Right. So then Drake, being as big as he is, Toronto is now known as the six. Oh my! So goodness. like, if you ask people, ask people in the U.S. Yeah. For the six, they no would way. know that as Toronto. Really? Yeah. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Bosses and parents and shit. 
<laughs> it's kind of lost on me. You don't know what? <laughs> yeah, there's so many references in there. This beat switch here is completely playing off of their collaboration from 2018. Oh, it's really similar in the way that the drums are. And but I'm liking this part. Yeah, once again, so Travis to have a mysterious outro just out yeah. of nowhere. Yeah. This is an automatic 11 out of 10 because of you know who. Just come outside for the night. Take your time. Get your life. So this is Playboy Cardi right now with this Playboy Cardi high pitch voice, yeah. yeah. Well, that's a name the I've heard. Is my estate when you and your prom. Fuck that paper, baby, my face on the dotted line. I've been flying out of town for some peace of mind. It's like always, they just want a peace of mind. I've been focused on the future, never on right now. Oh my gosh, I see how he has a verse, say. <laughs> Cardi is one of my favorite rappers. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. Oh, it's so Okay, this is not bad. No, no. <laughs> okay. He always plays around with his voice and stuff, so oh, yeah. I wasn't sure. Yeah. <laughs> but no, this is this is um Shackless. No, no, this is Homicide. There's a so Playboy Cardi's become such a big artist that he has his own label now. It's called Opium. Mm -hmm. And Opium has a lot of promising artists on it that sort of have it. They're like um the next they all look up to Cardi mm -hmm. and they emulate him mm -hmm. in some way in their aesthetic and everything. So there's certain people like Destroy Lonely is a really big artist, um, Ken Carson. And then also probably next in line after that in terms of popularity would be Homicide Gang. And there's two people, Homicide Michi and Homicide Bino. And uh, in the lyrics here, it says like Homicide, Homicide, Homicide. Like that. Oh, that that's their thing. Right, yeah. I, I thought they might just be doing the ad libs, but I was still expecting Cardi because it says the verses from Cardi. Yeah. And it just sounds nothing at all like him. Oh. So that tripped me out. Yeah. I'm feeling very old right now. <laughs> I like that background vocal that went, ooh, or something. Did yeah, what was that? Yeah, that was really cool. <laughs> yeah. yeah. But it's really dark sounding, so isn't it? So much, so much. Yeah. So is is this is this um sort of classic um is this typical of him? Of Travis. Of Travis? No, this yeah. is Travis um sort of getting with the times. Because mm -hmm. Travis now has a he's had a career of like ten years of making um like popular music. Yeah. And um lately, like the past three years or so, there's a certain subgenre of trap music. Um, called rage music, uh -huh. and it's characterized by these like intense synths yeah. that often like hold for a while with these huge eight away just banging away. And I think um, the reason why um, that style of music got really popular is because for our generation, like me and says, there's so much shit going on in the world. I mean, there's like the climate crisis, like COVID. Everyone's quite frustrated with things. Everything's expensive. There's sort of a sense of lack of freedom. Mm. And rage is just about raging out. Mm -hmm. The mosh pits happen. It's that style of music. So right. it's like a release of things. Mm, That's the way I, I see. see it. Right, 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 right. It's like, right. let's ignore everything else. Let's just... Yeah, I get that. 
for sure. Mm-hmm. So yeah. I think that's like the society right now is sort of making rage a thing. That's mm-hmm. why it's popular. So this is sort of like rage music that Play Bacardi does and Homicide Gang does. So it's not typ- typical of Travis. <laughs> So hard to let go. Oh, no, it's, it's Beyonce. I can see the echoes. Right to the thunder. Trying to see some more. I've never really heard Beyonce. I think I've heard little bits of mm-hmm. her, maybe. But I know she's a, like a hip hop artist, right? Mm-hmm. But this this vocal doesn't sound like hip hop. She sounds like some uh, white female singer from Europe or <laughs> Eng- England or something. To me, yeah, she has a lot of doesn't she, have that soul is. feeling. It's very kind of. Um, I don't know. She does weird stuff with her voice. Sometimes. Does she really? Yeah. Okay. I've heard this chord progression from somewhere before. Oh, really? Yeah. What did you think of that one? That one was so different from the rest. If, I know. If I'm not mistaken, yeah, the, the previous song was the Playboy Cardi song. Uh huh. That was so all opposite. Yeah. In the atmosphere. And Beyonce's chorus was so elegant sounding, which is which is neat. She had her time to shine. Yeah. And Travis's verses, I think he sort of let his voice just, just speak for itself. Uh huh. And just, he just wrote the music really nicely. Like, I don't know Travis, uh, aside from what I've heard so far in this album, mm-hmm. but if you'd played me those two songs side by side, I wouldn't have known they were the same. Art- yeah. Artist. Yeah. They're just so very different. different in their composition and, and just feel right. Yeah. Yeah. And this one had a really interesting structure too, which was very it refreshing. Did. First piano we've heard. Tell me, is she still love? It's 5 a.m. and I'm drunk right now. Tell me, can we still fuck? One on one, I'm in the zone right now. Tell me, am I still? Mm, you just how I feel right now. Okay, this is what Travis is perfect. Do you see how he's just so relaxed in his delivery? This almost and he's sounds just like mumble. cruising. Yeah, this I could consider maybe maybe mumble rap. <laughs> yeah, sure. Right? The way yeah. he's talking, right? Yeah, the way yeah. He's rapping. Really but but well. you know, he's just he's just feeling the beat. Dun, 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 yeah. Dun, dun, dun. yeah. So, so that's something that you have not. No, I haven't heard, heard that so at far. All. No, not at all. Yeah. Based on Say's reaction, I know I'm going to be subject. I like this song too, but I'm going to be subjected to this song during every car ride for the next six months. I can start to tell too. She still love. It's 5 a.m. and I'm drunk right now. Tell me, can we still fuck? One on one, I'm in the zone right now. Tell me, am I still? I'm telling you just how I feel right now. You say it's just this flow is like um. I know. It will never not work for Travis. He could keep releasing this type of music with this flow and this delivery, and everyone will eat it up until, you know, 2033 type of thing. Then again, I can be drunk. Yeah. I know, mommy, I know. It's 2 a.m. No strength. 
like the what are those things above cribs that spiral and they sort of play the sound? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, yeah that's yeah. what I was. Th- that's what I'm thinking of. Yeah, absolutely. Favorite one so far, say? Definitely up there. That up there. Fantastic song. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> twin bitches. Twin bitches. Twin oh, well. bitches hopping off a jet ski. Twin bitches. Twin bitches, uh, twin bitches up in up a jet ski. Yeah, it's so hard to hide on my dog, nigga. I make a mistake and short. Where I shoot my shot at all these holes, I fuck my shoulder. Oh. Travis, what if they twins and they saw me? Oh, it's not Travis rap. No, no. no. She want to suck her toes. I'm trying to make her come. Toilet thought. That, that is that some of the most crazy <laughs> lyrics. <laughs> that is wild. Okay. You know this life been busy, man. I'm busy on me. And I come through, throw a pack. She never leaves. Okay, yeah. Oh yeah, I don't even you know we're we're in this deep already with with some of the the, the lyrics and yeah, the yeah, shit yeah. that we've but pretty, just pretty raw stuff. Yeah. Look at you don't even need to read it out loud. We just read the Thank God. <laughs> Where I shoot my shot at all these holes, I fuck my shoulder up. Travis, what if they twins and they saw me, but they won't fuck us both? Yeah. Why would she want to suck our toes? I'm trying to make it come. Told her throw it back and put that pussy on me. Yeah. Twin bitches, okay, I'm you're about to hear 21 Savage. Twin bitches, twin, twin drapes, twin glock, twin jets. Try the planes, I don't ride prop, slow stroke. Yeah. Front of back, I've been drinking walk, edge rays, cat scans, nigga, ask my off. Ten bad bitches in the studio, they all props. Treat them niggas like rhythmic radio, they all pop. Should have got some lipo, she got shots, now her ass drop. Slime sitting in a cell, I bet he coming home like pop. I got the vision, ain't no dipping in that ayahuasca. This shit get thicker than the bitch with stripes at the shoot. Hey, twin, call her twin, tell her I'm in town now. London bitch, she wanna leave, she dropped a pin to pound town. Ask it, when she walk it, got I get desensitized to this sort of stuff. Like, like to me, it's just like, yeah, she this is. Like the way the soul chop and make a bounce. You know what I mean? Say, when she hit me, she from the cold in the summer, keep a me. Tell me what you're doing for. It's funny because this chorus here is relatively innocent, you know? Yeah, the chorus is, yeah. If she get too annoying, find a beach. Twin bitches, twin bitches, twin bitches hopping up a jet ski. Something tells me that song is going to be played over and over by people. Just that whole... Twin bitches, twin bitches hopping off a jet ski. Just that. It's just so... Uh, I don't know. You can just picture it, right? Yeah. Oh, those lyrics are some of the rawest lyrics I've heard in rap so far. Mm -hmm. You know? Yeah. Yeah, I mean, thinking back to the 90s rap I've heard, some of that can be pretty raw, but this stuff, my goodness. (laughs) Because they're like like just getting creative with it. Yeah, I guess so. (laughs) For lack of a better Um, term. Yeah. uh, (laughs) Yeah. yeah, I was like, you're you're gonna need a whole lot more alcohol to yeah. <laughs> enjoy this song. Unreal, what is this? God done gave me strength. Are these the this makes me think of, of Kendrick. Oh yeah, so much. This right? Is, yeah. Off the new album. Th- that was Sway Lee, a really big artist. One half of a, a duo called Ray Shremer. Sounds like the weekend. It's the weekend. You know the boy off. I know we travel. So I need me a town ball. I've been up in Cabo with my baby of Santo. I'm waiting on a letter. You're gonna have to display your your feelings on tape. But you know what?
I love the ending of this. After the weekend stops again. <laughs> oh, and, and then I liked it. Yeah. Yeah, yeah well. And yeah, well, that was that was so different from all the other songs. Sure again, was. Mm -hmm. every single song is completely unlike Which, the other Yeah, it's right? quite amazing in that way. Yeah. Well, if you love it so much, sounds like it's ready for a shot. Oh, yeah. <laughs> more, more drinks. Bring them on. Bring sure. them on. What do we got here today? Um, oh, I actually don't know. Oh, there's triple sec in there, rum in there, grape cranberry juice. Okay. Yeah. I don't think I've ever had triple sec. I don't it's, even know what it's is. Like orange flavor? <laughs> this is <laughs> it's a strong. This is large. This is a large shot and a strong. Come on, come on. Okay, do one go. <laughs> oh. Oh. Wow. <laughs> I'm not able oh, to. God. I'm not able able to open my throat and just pour. Is it that down. a double entendre? What? Abel? Abel? I don't get it. The weekend's name is Abel. Abel? Really? Yeah. His name's Abel. Yeah. That's his actual name. Yeah. Oh. A B E L. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh boy, what do we got now? <laughs> These are just um, berry marks. The last time I've had tequila, I had tequila was. The night before I left for my very first journey to Japan, back in 86, and I got as drunk as a skunk with a good friend of mine in tequila. I think I barely made the flight. Oh, God. <laughs> yeah. And I've just stayed away from it ever since then. <laughs> I get up. I fall. I get up. This next person is success comes so easy for you. They're waiting behind the car. Right, Pat, oh, see you. Thank you. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Crazy feature. Oh. I did not see this coming. The voice sounds familiar, but I can't just can't place it. Who is it? Success comes so easy for you. It's Young Lee. Yeah. Young Lee. Rolling through the grass. Shedding down the trees. I will fight for everything I love forever. Fight this is a beautiful track. Yeah, but, uh, really, really nice. Wonder what you wanna do when you're not with me. Oh, that's it. Yeah, a little interlude. Didn't uh, I've heard that one Youngling song? Agony. Yeah, which was very good. Mm -hmm. Didn't sound anything like him. It isn't the voice sounds quite different? But that was mm. a was that an early young lady? Yeah, that would have been twenty uh, maybe twenty sixteen, twenty seventeen. Yeah. Okay. Well, not that young, uh, not that early, but yeah. yeah. Hmm. Mm hmm. I really enjoyed that. That was, I I sort of needed that after all. Very that. introspective and quiet. Yeah. 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 Young. Well, just the young lean. I know we've covered one song, but. It is it is pretty crazy that Young Lean is on here, being the artist that he is. He's uh -huh. so like low key, stays away from a lot of stuff. He's not featured pretty often, so bizarre feature. So bizarre for him to be featured on such a high yes. profile album as, yes. as this. Exactly. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah. I gotta hear more Young Lean. I really want to. Back I, lied, up. I lied. I lied. Did I lied. you like that one, say? Yeah, I loved it. Did yeah, you? I, I, I saw a big smile on your face, so I had to ask. Yeah, him. in the beginning, I don't know. If Kai heard me, but I like asked if he saw who was featured because I knew he. Oh, I didn't hear that. Oh, yeah. yeah. You knew Young Lean was coming up. But yeah, when I saw that, I was a bit shocked. Yeah. So no free tickets for you. No <laughs> free tickets. What's this one? Schizo. Schizo. Sounds like a song that Eminem would put out. <laughs> Produced by Boy Wonder. Be right back as long as Told you I'ma be right back as long as Do that dip, do that dip.
One thing I can say about this album so far though, I know that there's just so many lyrics that I'm trying to pay attention to both the music and the lyrics, but in terms of the lyrics, it's definitely not Travis's best by any means, um, which is... I don't know. Bling, bling, I get a rest every time I see some diamonds. She get it up, she gon' bounce it like a stay away, find it hard, why I can't play. Top ten pinless, I don't even know how to pin this. Knowing that I'm the human Pinterest, need true love, but I know true love's like a friendship. But even Titanic got it ended. I rock the boat with ice so expensive, hair long, not no extensions. Money long, shit is extended. She need me now, she need me a pendant. I said you need me now, I ain't finished, huh? I said you need me now. I said you need me now. You need me. <laughs> Stick to the cold, binary like eyes and nose. I'm too exposed, I gotta keep curtains closed. That was just sort of a. I mean, it's cool the different beat switches, but in terms of an actual song, yeah, sort yeah, of yeah, whatever. I, I'm like, I'm, I, you know, I, I, after. Um, Oh, it's still going on. Hold on. No, 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 this is the next song. Oh. <laughs> After all the rap we've listened to, I've heard like what, a hundred and probably two hundred or more. Oh no, rap songs? way more than that. Really? Yes, yes, yeah. yes. But mostly from the sort of late eighties and then the like I said earlier, the nineteen nineties a lot mm -hmm. and the two thousands, right? Mm -hmm. Two thousand, two thousand and ten. Yeah. And I was feeling like, hey, I'm really starting to get a feel for this stuff and some of the language. Yeah, the lingo that's not my lingo. I'm starting to understand what it means. Yeah. And then getting a feel for the themes and all of that stuff. Mm -hmm. And I'm getting a feeling for the, uh, for the actual technicalities of the wrapping mm -hmm. starting to, you know, and it's really, it was, it's so exciting. It's so great. Yeah. But uh, a song like this and some of the other songs in this album are leaving me feeling like I really don't get it. I don't right. get it. I'm not getting the, uh, it's just, it's so different from the rap I've been listening to. Yeah. You know? Yeah. Have you ever been lost? Hmm. Have you okay. Ever been I saw who was featured on here, but. Forever. Lost on Alice oh, That voice sounded familiar. Chuck Senrick? No, I don't know. <laughs> no. Sorry, Chuck, never heard of you. This is the sample of Chuck Senrick's soul jazz song, Don't Be So Nice, from his 1976 obscure record, Obs Dreamin'. There you go, obscure record, good. Yeah. Well, not good, not good for Chuck, but uh, good for me. <laughs> good, yeah, good riddance. Yeah. No, no, I liked it, I liked the voice. Start at the start. Have you ever been lost? She jump up, bounce back like trampoline. Hey yo, whip the cocaine to the pop up. <laughs> you was on the porch, I was All locked up. Suits on made back truck with the Maxwell. Right, so this is West Side Gun. <laughs> and what this, a this is West Side Gun's album right here. Pray for Paris. No way. Yeah. <laughs> he's like, um, he's from Buffalo. Yeah. New York, and they have a group called Griselda. They're sort of taking Boom Bat from the 90s and then recontextualizing it uh -huh. with some newer vocabulary and, and style yeah. and more uh, stre stretching the boundaries of Boom Bat. And they've, it's, they've made such a splash. And not just really? a splash, but they've been established now. There's three of them, Benny the Butcher, West Side Gun, and Conway the Machine. All fantastic rappers. I'd love to get in into their work. Tay told a different color face on the road. Sitting on his head, he'd be dead by the morning. I could get 30 for the stove. D your trench shit, hey to the flow. D your goggles, I ain't playing with your rose. Out on South Beach with the pose in the road. Sandals, alligators on the toes. Fast week, I'm a shrimp, two bitches. Honey round drum, make a nigga go get it. He want the whole dub dub E, but I ain't convinced. Never met her, she but she met Shaq, she don't need a prince. Took her off the O into the D, she ain't take offense. Wait, we got it bouncing off the boards, we make it prince. Wait until I step into the floor, then it may commence. Sounds like a wood block or something. It's called, it's called, it's called love. Okay. Love. 
Fill it in my cheese, the jack of my steez, please. 500 degrees, nigga, who hotter than me? Y'all feel like that? Y'all feel like that? They let me, let me, let me, yeah, they let me long time. They let me, they let me, let it show me love. They let me, let me, let me, yeah, they let me long time. They let me, they let me, let it show me love. We raise our glasses, the madness, the tiny with the asses, dancing in trances. So this is Travis, uh, not Travis Scott. This is Kid Cudi. Kid Cudi. Music's great here. Yeah. This is the this is the cover for the single. Wow, what the hell am I looking at? <laughs> it's just a red lollipop. Oh, it's a red lollipop. Okay. All right. Okay, here you go. Yeah. So this is Bad Bunny. Why does Spanish sound so sexy? <laughs> I wish I spoke Spanish. <laughs> This guy, Bad Bunny, is a huge artist. Is he? Like weekend level size. Tell the friends we gon' party. This ain't some little yachty. We gon' fuck till we see you. You my bad little mommy, mommy. You love me. You could tell me you love me. Even if you don't mean it. Sex will make you believe it. I love it when she up on me. Love when she call me poppy. Even though she go read. the biggest weekend haters online. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, I, I'm going to have to listen to some weekend eventually at, at, at gunpoint maybe, you know. <laughs> so, I don't know. Oh, it, it'll come eventually. But I, I, I'm not, I'm not uh, <laughs> too thrilled. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not really waiting for it. Yet. Yeah, so that's that's the song. Oh, yeah. Really? Mm-hmm. Yeah. It's too hard to fuck an RB bitch and that shit happen. I could have took pain and I could have went outside. Street stepped in, raised me, but I ain't have my dad. Niggas trying to clone me, run out with my sweat. From selling cocoa, got Chanel on my jet. Shorty give me my but the less it don't last. Taking more drugs all alone in a mansion. Walking around tweaking with that yop in my hands. Just another pro code, just preaching for these bands. And I know I'm due for a billion dollar Okay, I. See, this, this is the this first is... introspection on the entire album. <laughs> I know, right? I know. Right? This, this is... Future is addicted to drugs. He lives a very hedonistic lifestyle. But then he has moments, like a couple songs in an album, where he'll yeah. sprink in, sprinkle in this self-awareness. Yeah. And it just makes you like almost shed a tear because it's like, this is... Yeah. This guy's realizing this. And you know what? Okay. Um, <laughs> To me, yeah, there's introspection here, mm -hmm. and I'm feeling future, man. Mm -hmm. And in a certain way, I haven't been feeling Travis on this album, but I'm feeling this. This guy's a human with two different sides to him. Mm -hmm. We all have two different sides. Oh, I like to think we've got two different sides, or or more than just the hedonistic thing going on, right? Mm -hmm. And I'm I'm getting this from this. Yeah. So oh, this yeah. is like this is one of my favorite verses so far. <laughs> yeah, me too. Yeah, shoot. Okay, I'm going back to the beginning. Say's so laughing because <laughs> she's like, oh my gosh, <laughs> these guys. <laughs> Not that deep, you guys. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, what'd you say, Sid? <laughs> Nothing. What do you say? I said it's not that deep, you guys. <laughs> <laughs> Everything's relative. I can't wait to live in glory and eternity. Oh, I love this melody. Might as well turn up now. He gonna pop up on the now. Say the trumpets. Do you like the way it sounds?
You know the future to bounce. I'm really enjoying this so far. Yeah, me too. It's giving me a uh, little Yachty uh, vibe. I can see the future. Riding with the storm and some troopers. Riding through the shit and shit is stupid. Uh, Count so much money to my skin, bitch. You eat again to money, you guys. She chose a prom stroke, now she's lottery Places I thought I'd never go, I found models in. I hear the demons clear when they call it Lights on the earth, so I had to name myself a planet Automatic dead when you going against my family If you break us my public, I just bought another baddie So cold, so cold You can see the future is a sparkle in your eye When you wall up on my thigh, you can't let go Niggas plying my demise, I got murder on my mind I got money on the line, I can't lose If I try, let no bitch break my stride Joe's and I'm gon' bet on me Joe's and all my shit antique Holes and I can't feel no heat Diamonds dancing on me Sousa, have you heard of that name before? No She was signed to Kendrick's label, TD, Top Dog Entertainment, back in the day since then, she's become probably the biggest contemporary R&B artist. Really? Yeah. You'd say, right, say? Yeah. Yeah, some introspection there from uh, Future. And then also from uh, Travis. From Travis a little bit. Right? I, I, again, I'm not, I'm not really sure what it's all about, but he's talking about... Uh, the trumpets um, <laughs> might as well turn up now. Yeah. I like this line. Won't you take the wheel? I recline and I sit still. Mm-hmm. I don't know what it means, but I like I like the image. Might as well turn up now. He's going to pop up and announce God. Well, yeah, right? I think the whole thing to the trumpets. Do you like the way it sounds? Won't God take the yeah. wheel? I recline and I sit still. I let him take me on this journey. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. He's going to pop up. And, yeah, yeah. So... I can't wait to live in glory and ever in eternal lasting life. Well, I'm a sucker for future. And I thought he made the song completely. Yeah. I, I, I really was, I was honed in on every single line. Were you really? Yeah. yeah I, I really like his delivery. It's good. Um, you can feel his, his uh, conflicting interests, you know? Uh huh. Yeah, um, yeah. 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 He's you, addicted to certain things, but he also can. wants something else. And he realizes yeah. the way that he feels and the way that other people feels. So a flurry of emotions and just like the way he delivers it. Mm -hmm. He's so like, it sounds like he's mumbling a little bit, but he's actually super precise with everything, which I don't know how he does it. Till further notice. Okay. Oh, we're going to wait another decade at this point for the next one. The biggest hip hop releases of the past right. ten years. It's alright. I should have waited some I should have never pushed so hard. Now you running around playing payback and that shit hurt. I should have treated you better. Too. Used to deal with lanes till she ran into a stepper. Big dog savage, I'm a zone six rapper. Niggas throwing salt, but the Draco came with pepper. She said we ain't going nowhere cause all I do is sex with okay. Whoa, never knew that I had to propose. Ooh. Thanks for thanks for listening with yeah, me. Yeah, that was great. Exciting. We both reacted yeah, to it for the first it was, time. It was. So it was fun. And say thanks for hanging in till the very end and uh, for those wonderful drinks. Oh, thanks for having me. <laughs> <laughs> I hope you enjoy this album and let us know your thoughts on the album below in the comments. We always read the comments. Um, so have a great day and see ya. See you again soon, everybody. <laughs>